top of the morning my creatives welcome back to the channel i hope all is well with you i'm here because i have received my first tag from the tag swap that i was in with Susie, and so i have received this tag um from tina who is hummingbird tails here on the yt in a video prior <coughs> i've showed you all um the the tags that i made um, for the swap and so this is my my return swap and if you did not see that video I will um, tag it down in the description box let's dive in so she sent this I pulled it out the package love 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 how um, she sent it she is from overseas um, and I was just excited to um, meet a new friend to be able to swap with and uh, share beautiful creations. I love, love, love this. And then she has a doily here. Look at that deer. Isn't he gorgeous? So beautiful. All right, I'm going to open this from the bottom because I do not want to mess up the bag topping. I would love to reuse that or perhaps put it inside of my journal so we have glassine bags so there will be some some noise all right so she sent me all oh, some eyelash trim and you all know tina loves her eyelash trim i got gold and i got silver thank you tina oh look at this one this is a different one than i've ever seen Oh, I like that. Oh, that's so that's blue. And one thing I learned about Tina already is that blue is her favorite color. She loves creating with blue. Gold is one of my favorite colors, so I do love this blue and gold combination. I cannot wait to use some of it because it's so pretty. It's probably going to go in my vault. Then she sent me uh, shades of purple in the trim now this is a delicate one. Oh yeah this is really nice thank you so much tina and they got various colors look at the different shades of purple thank you that's interesting cannot wait to play with that and then she sent me an all white one you all and it looks like um like tiny um cotton balls you could use this for like a snow Oh, that's delicate and that's cute. Thank you. This is very interesting. I've never seen any of these before. Very, very interesting. So she sent me that as a little gift. All right, let's open this. I don't know if this is the tag or no, but I, we're just going to open as we go, right, and discover and explore. Let's see. There was no, um, no, really no guidelines. Oh, I think this is her tag. On the tag, oh, look at it. How gorgeous. Too cute. Oh, wow. So this is a very thin tag. I like it. This is like more on a bookmark style. Oh, I love the size of this. Okay, I have to try this size. Oh, this is cute. So she has did some mixed media techniques. Some um, painting and inking and coloring. She did some um, textures behind the scene. We have a piece of, this look like drywall tape. I love that on top of paper. And then here's another like, this like a bead sequence type. I don't know how she put that on there. Or did she do that individually? That is cute. We got stitching over here on the side. And then I love this fabric bow. Cute. And she got the little charms hanging. One kind word can warm three winter months. Oh, I love it. This is breathtaking. And then she got the bank of snow down here that she used with. This is not 
a cotton ball. This is like a piece of fabric or something like that. I can't really describe it. Can you all see it? That is gorgeous. I love the tag, Tina. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. I hope she liked my tag. <laughs> oh, it's so totally different. Oh, okay. Let's see. Look like she sent me some more goodies. Oh, Tina, you didn't have to. Thank you. All right, I see a chocolate bunny. Okay. And we have some chocolate candy. I love me some chocolate. So she really, she really getting to know me well. She sent me some ephemera. Yes, she makes journals on her on her on her channel. I did see that. Thank you. Oh, look at this. This is like an actual photo, you all. Yes. Interesting. Oop. Oh, this is a vintage, authentic. This is a postcard. Look at that, you all. Wow. Thank you, Tina. Here's another one. These are authentic postcards. Oh, wow. Look at the back. Oh, my goodness. It got the real stamp postmarked. Oh, my goodness. This, this is from 1928, you all. March the 2nd. Oh, wow. These are authentic. These are, like, original. These are, like, real. Oh, wow. Thank you, Tina. Oh my goodness. Look at how it's worn. It's so old. Another postcard. This is beautiful. Thank you so much for sharing, Tina. Oh, I will cherish those. I will cherish those. She sent me some napkins. And you all on my full deck challenge i'm going to be using some napkins as well thank you tina love these spring colors in this napkin beautiful yes look at this don't that scream spring i love it spring spring is in the air you all thank you so much tina Oh my, oh, look at this one. Y'all know what I see. Look at the purple, pink, and the orange. Yes, this is definitely spring. Too cute. And what I like about napkins, napkins can go a long way. I mean, I could use, because I'm going to be using it on those cards, I only need one panel of this. And so then I got th three other panels to use in another project napkins go a long way look at those pink and purple butterflies oh my goodness i want to open it up you all this oh this is breathtaking oh i love i think this is my favorite <laughs> and y'all know i do not rock pink but i like those that is beautiful. Those are beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that's a gorgeous napkin. And this one is another Yale for Spring. Oh, she sent me two. Thank you so much, Tina. These are nice. And they got the blue border on them. Beautiful. All right, then we got something down here with the bumblebees. This is a cute envelope oh look at the card be happy oh this is going into my journal oh she wrote me a note oh she did a winter tag yes oh i thank you for accepting me and swapping for me tina yes thank you thank you thank you i love this envelope and the, this card is definitely going to go into my journal 
All right, you all, I'm going to get back to working with my journal. I have not been working with my journal in a while. And so this will prompt me to um, jumpstart and start working in that journal. I did make a new journal a few weeks ago. And so in preparations for um, spring to come, I wanted to start. And so this will be the first item that I put in my journal. Thank you so much, Tina, for this gorgeous, gorgeous gorgeous tag you all go pay her a visit she is hummingbird tails here on the yt let her know that i sent you family over um to uh play with her she has some very very sweet and nice creations it is my prayer that you all stay blessed keep washing your hands social distance and uh, most of all keep creating most of all, no matter what's going on around us, what's going on in our lives, keep creating. When we create, we release stress, we release anger, and we are at a calm state. Art brings us to a happy place. So keep creating, family. I love you all. Pray for me. I pray for you. Till next time, you all stay blessed.